Look at all I got. Hey guys, welcome back to Rick's Flicks. I just got back from at, being at the parks and shopping. Uh, doing something a little different. I don't know if we'll ever quite do it again. This is a one-time deal. And I'll explain why after this. So this is a little different. I've seen other vid YouTube videos where they've done, you know, like a haul video where they kind of show all the stuff that they just bought. Well, I thought that'd be kind of interesting. Um, this is, like I said, a one-time deal, I think. Uh, my dad works for Universal. He works at, for a retirement job at the turnstiles. He's, he's one of those little old guys that, you know, checks you in as you're coming through the turnstiles. Well, he's been on furlough and he's not sure if he's gonna be able to go back in, um, next year. What happens is team members in December get 50% off of merchandise, yeah. So I was like, this is a deal that I can't miss out on. Um, all this stuff that I've been wanting for a while that I've had my eye on and all those vlogs that you've seen, I can finally make it happen. So I just wanna show you guys all the cool stuff that I got. Now, not all of it is for me and Rick. <laughs> Bear in mind, uh, it's for friends and family too. So if you guys are watching, shut your eyes. <laughs> all right, so let's get started. The first thing I got was the glassware. So the glassware for each of the old iconic vintage vintage rides. The first one's ET, so it's got ET with the kids on the bis on the bicycles and Jaws. Even shows the scene from the ride of being on the boat. Super cool. The next one is Kong, so I thought Kong was really super cute, and Back to the Future, of course, my favorite. Uh, and speaking of Back to the Future, I did get a Back to the Future shirt, which I'll show you in a little bit. All pretty cool, right? So I'll show you what else I got, too. Digging through my bags. You know how like you get that rush when you go shopping and you're like, oh, I gotta show you what I got? So when my girls go shopping and they come home and they, have, they come home with clothes, we're like, fashion show, fashion show. So always fun to show people what you get when you get it right so all those times when you know you're like yeah I'm not paying full price well I finally took advantage of that 50% so I can't wait to show you here we go so the next thing I got was a little troll doll super super cute I'm very fluffy love her hair I mean honestly who doesn't love that so that's for a special little someone for a favorite teacher in your life I got it. teacher of all things mm-hmm so I have another special teacher in my life that I'm going to share that with. Another really cool vintage thing that looks like it's from the 90s is this like crop top t-shirt. Very adorable. This is 30. Got it for 15. Can't beat that price. But yep, super cute little vintage shirt. Here is that Back to the Future shirt. The one that I wear all the time for myself. Yep. I love it. It's super soft. A lot of the clothes too with Universal, they don't shrink. They hold their shape really well. They don't pill or anything. And this was one of them. That was, it's a super soft shirt that maintains its structure. You know, when you wash things, sometimes that happens with, you know, your clothes. Not these. These are great. This is super cute. Long sleeve E.T. t-shirt with E.T. the extraterrestrial down the sleeve. It's a pretty lightweight t-shirt. Probably better for Florida than it would be for colder states. But I thought that was adorable. Now let's get into the Harry Potter merchandise. Stuff I love, you know that. I did that vlog where we went Christmas shopping in Diagon Alley. I didn't buy anything that day, but I saw a bunch of stuff I wanted. So today I took advantage. <laughs> All right, so the first one is the snitch, the golden snitch. Super, super cute. Nice and shiny, love it. It's gonna look great on the tree. I got that Nimbus 2001 that I like was like, oh, I have to have that. So cute. The Quidditch cup, which that ornament. Again, I love the little details of like, it's got the Hogwarts crest on the back. It's got the two brooms crossed and the cup. It's really cute. Oh, here's the deal that they're running at Universal right now. I'm not sure how long it's gonna last. I'll put that in the description below. I forgot to make a mental note of that. But if you spend $195, at any one store, you can get a free non-interactive wand. So I was like, um, yeah. <laughs> so I tried to make that happen. I was working really hard. So my dad was actually there too and he was purchasing some stuff. So between the two of us, we got two. Yeah, first one uh, is 
Queenie Goldstein. So her box, when they brought the box out, I was like, oh my gosh, I can't believe this was free. So it's got the, you know, pretty green on the top and the polka dot yellow on the bottom. So cute. So when we open it up, her wand looks like this. So it's got that pretty shell with the different colors and um, almost like a marble type of look. Really like that. Now the non-interactive ones obviously don't come with the map. So this is what the map looks like. So with your interactive ones, you'll get one of the maps. And I'll show you because I did end up getting an interactive wand too. Now the Death Eater wand, it's pretty awesome. I mean, really, it's got the skull and then it's got Maybe it's a snake wrapping around it. I know what it reminds me of. It reminds me of when they do the magic spell up in the sky and then it's that green skull with the snake kind of coming through the mouth. That's what it looks like. It's pretty awesome. They got some clothing items too. Let's start with the most obvious item. If you know at Rick's Licks what color and what house Rick is and what shirt he wears all the time, and <laughs> most of my laundry is yellow. So he goes through those shirts. He doesn't just have one. He's got 20 something. Well, now I'm adding four more to our laundry list. <laughs> so I got him his Hufflepuff shirt so he can look bright and shiny <laughs> in the parks. If you are looking for a particular size and they don't have it, I probably cleaned them out. It's probably because <laughs> you won't be able to find that particular size. I'm not sharing what size that is though. So my daughter is a Slytherin, my daughter Courtney. So if Courtney's watching, don't look. Close your eyes. <laughs> so I got her pajama pants. Super cute. They have them in all of the houses. They run about $30 and then there's like a matching tank top too that goes with them. I was looking at like sweaters and hoodies and sweatshirts and I will tell you walking through the parks what the number one sweatshirt is for when it's 60 degrees or colder when you're at the parks this was the number one thing i saw walking around was this one it's pretty cool it's got the you know the gryffindor colors um obviously there's all four houses in there and then it's got the emblem on the sleeve but that the, that was the funny thing though is i was going around looking and i'm like just noticing what people were wearing around the park and that was the number one. So a tradition that I wanted to share you, with you guys of a piece of merchandise that we get every single year for New Year's Eve, in fact, is because we're big Harry Potter fans, you know, I mean, come on, we drink a little bit of Felix Felicis. So we drink this on New Year's Eve. You can put it in your tea or just drink it straight. I mean, it's pretty much sugar, <laughs> but it's fantastic. And we make a little wish as we're drinking our Felix Felicis toasting the new year. So if you haven't ever tried it, maybe we should all drink a little bit so that 2021 can be the best year yet. I forgot to show you the other wand. Okay, whoop, back to the other wand. All right, so here we go. I did get myself um, my very own wand. Now I have my mom's old wand, which was Narcissa Malfoy. And then you guys, the subscribers, actually you guys like pitched in and was able to get like the 2020 uh, commemorative like wand, the 2020 wand. So, I was, I have that at the house, but the thing about the, those year ones, those dated ones, limited editions, is that if it gets scratched or broken and it won't perform magic for you anymore, they they can't replace any of the parts. Like in, in my heart of hearts, I'm like, I don't want to get it broken. I want it to be perfect. So it just sits up on my little shelf, you know, hanging out, um, looking pretty. <laughs> But I ended it, so I've never really gotten myself like a wand that I know I'm going to use. So when I was there, I was talking to one of the team members at the wand shop and they said that the number one wand was Hermione's because I asked, I was like, oh, let me see the Hermione's wand. Well, I ended up getting it. He said that that's, he, that sells far beyond Ron and Harry's wands, which I was surprised by. I thought Harry's might be the number one wand to sell, but it's Hermione's. So I'll show you what Hermione's looks like. So... We have the box and then of course inside the box with the interactive wands is your map that shows all the places on the map uh, that you can perform both in Diagon Alley and in Hogsmeade. We also did a video on all of the secret wand spots too so I'll put a link in that below so you can find out where all the secret wand spots are press all your you know your family members be like hey there's one over here and they said it's not on the map and you'd be like I know I know I'm a pro yeah we're looking out for you 
All right, so back to Hermione's wand. Herm Hermione's wand is ivy with dragon heart string in its core. So, and it's really, really pretty. It does have, it's covered in an ivy filigree around the end of the wand. And then again, if it, the tip gets broken or scratched and it's not performing the wands that, or the spells that you want it to, you can take it into Ollivander's and they will replace it for you. They'll replace the, the sensor, the core. Let's get to the clothing. Right now they're running a deal with Neville's sweater. And I think they're going to, once it's sold out, they're not going to renew it. According to the team member that I spoke to, they said that um, it's on sale at 70 now. So I was debating whether I got Neville's sweater, which I could wear all the time. You know, I could wear it everywhere because Neville's sweater just looks like a muggle sweater in a way, like a little, you know, a cardigan. Or I really was thinking I was going to get Ron. They didn't have my size. I went to like three different places. They didn't have my size. I guess that's a popular sweater too. What are you wearing? Oh, mum made it. Looks like you got one too. I ended up getting Harry's, but Harry's is great. Here's Harry's sweater. It is Austrian wool and it's from Scotland. So I thought that these were great. Um, you might want to wear a t-shirt under it when you're wearing it. So definitely pick a cool day to wear it outside because it would be warm and maybe a little itchy too because the material that it's kind of a, it's not a super soft material but I mean how can you pass up a Harry Potter authentic sweater that Molly Weasley knitted for you right exactly mm -hmm. the last things I got was um, a Hogwarts alumni t-shirt I got this sweatshirt and I love this sweatshirt so much I actually wear it to work <laughs> and all the kids love it honestly I get compliments when I wear my Hogwarts sweatshirt at work but I ended up getting a, a t-shirt too so that I can wear it year-round instead of it just being during the cold here in Florida. So that's about it. That's my haul. It's been pretty good. So I got my Christmas shopping done in one spot. So what I'll do is I'll leave the link to the uh, Universal website, the phone number that you can also call if there's any merchandise that you see here, or um, the email address that you can send an email to them requesting that merchandise. So it's been great guys. Thanks a lot for hanging out with me and letting me show you all the cool stuff that I just got for all my friends and family at my trip to Universal. And just like always, don't miss the magic, don't, don't miss the fun. Hi, my name is Daniela from West Palm Beach, Florida. Don't miss the magic, don't miss the fun. Subscribe. Don't miss the magic, don't miss the fun. Thanks for watching Rich Slicks. And now it's time to relax.